Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I hope you like my view. It's a frozen lake, a very frozen lake, and it's giving me winter wonderland vibes, which is perfect because it is almost Christmas and I'm very excited. Hence the bow that's just um, blocking the view. Also, yes, I've dyed my hair back brown again because I don't know what the blonde it's very hard to keep up when it has this dark naturally like trying to keep it up in the van and go to all these different hairdressers and try and explain what you want done in a different language is just a recipe for disaster honestly so I was just like make my hair dark I don't care how you do it just make it dark oh my god just did the biggest shit right outside the van it's face. It knows it's done dirty. Anyway, let's go on this walk. I need to warm up, ironically, by going outside. Okay, I am now ready. Let's go. God, the, the bow's just sticking out the top of my van. <laughs> that was a pretty walk. I just don't know what to do now because I want to have like an outside fire because I've wanted to do that for ages. And I don't mind this car park, but there's just quite a lot of people here and I want to park somewhere a bit more secluded. There's a place about 40 minutes away, which looks pretty cute. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to it because of the snow, but I reckon we just do it anyway. To the cab! The biggest downside to Christmas in a van is every time you move, you have to move about 700 items. Like, Christmas tree, two plants, this guy. It is stressful. If you don't live in a van, just imagine having to pack your whole house up every time you want to do something. It's not fun. Okay, I'm going now. Okay, so I've chosen here. It's gonna be covered in snow, but... Okay, let's try it. Let's just try it. You know what? What's the worst that's gonna happen? something uh mushrooms and other stuff so let's go really trying to not be dramatic but i just don't understand 
just gonna cheat and use a fire stuff. cooking. We are cooking slowly, but surely. Okay, I'm gonna try and make a Christmas tree because that's literally <laughs> the only reason I came to a wooded area is because I wanted to make a full-size Christmas tree. Okay, so I got all this stuff. I just want a big Christmas tree, you know? <laughs> so I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm literally about a five seconds away from having a mental breakdown, I'm not even kidding. Everybody ready? Okay, review. Oh! Okay, that's... It's a bit shit, but it's also... That's quite cute. Wonderful. <laughs> to be honest, I'm gonna eat that later. I'm just here for the marshmallows. I haven't roasted a marshmallow in ages. Oh, I forgot to tell you a story. Was it yesterday or the day before? The day before, I drove my van into a car park, noticed a pool of water under the van, but the next day, the water was still there. I thought it was from like a different car, but it's not. Turns out my jerry can had fallen over in the back. All my clothes were just wet along the bottom. And obviously, I don't really have anywhere to dry all the clothes, so it was just stressful. I'm not gonna lie, but it was fine. Because now I'm mo <laughs> Moasting? Now I'm roasting the marshmallow in the woods and I have a giant Christmas tree so things could be worse. <laughs> this is taking so long. Oh. oh, this is like proper roasted. Like not burnt, but roasted. Toasted. I don't know. Okay, ignore where I touch the grill with the marshmallow, but like. Are you kidding? Yes. That's hot though. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, this is literally the best marshmallow I've ever had. Like, best toasted marshmallow. Barbecue marshmallows, USA. Oh, this is so fun. I genuinely cannot explain how good these are. Wait. They're like butter. It's weird. Mm. Okay, I've ended up inside. Um, because I may or may not have freaked myself out and it was all in my head. <laughs> oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> oh my god, get out my van. 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 Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. I hate things like this, I hate things like this, I hate things that fly. Oh fuck it. Yeah. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Fucking man up. It's a moth, it's literally a moth. Oh my god, my nervous system cannot take this. I'm gonna say that it went, but I don't think it did. So it's just me who gets really scared by <laughs> flying things. Like those crane flies. Those like long legged crane flies. Oh! I used to. <laughs> get out! Get out! Get out my van! Oh, it's kind of cute. No, it's not. It's not cute. I literally, I know it's a moth. It's literally a moth, and it's actually quite cute. And I don't want to hate nature, but I just can't deal with the flying. I'm literally being such a worst today. What is wrong with me? Oh, this reminds me of the time with Scatola, the spider. That was so scary. I still don't know what happened to that spider. Right, Gigi, I really love you, but right now I'm just really scared by a moth. Okay, not screw it. I'm just gonna go. No, we can't. 
I don't know if I'm even gonna be able to get out this space because it's so snowy. Okay, so I was gonna stay here the night, but now I just, I don't want to really, to be honest. I just don't wanna stay here. Um, so I'm actually gonna go back to Antsy to my parents because it's almost Christmas. That's gonna go tomorrow, but I might just go now because I've got nothing else to do. I'm fucking terrified I'm gonna get stuck here. How? How did I just make that? Oh my god! I actually just made it! Oh, I was so scared I was gonna get stuck. Okay, if I kind of go for like a run up, that's probably my best option. car park with my parents it's all good okay i don't know how this happened but i drove with the back doors open i literally freaked out water was coming in because it was raining and i was like i can't figure out where it's coming from and then i was like well, the only other place it would be would be here i saw and i was like why is there a gap the doors were like they were together but they weren't attached to this so they were just like flapping around in the wind when driving how did i not notice i've done it once before but it, this was for like an hour and a half journey how how does that happen i'm grateful nothing got lost i'm slightly concerned that if it was the bow's problem you can see the bow's got like these dents in it it's because it was trapped in the top oh god that was so dramatic anyway tomorrow i'll probably go christmas shopping the funny thing about being in a van is it's like, oh, what do we do for Christmas dinner? We're going to try and make one still. But the funny thing is we can't get any kind of Christmas food until like Christmas Eve because we have no way of storing it. You kind of just have to go with whatever's left in the shops. <laughs> but it's part of the fun. Okay, two options. I stay in the van and clean it, or we go out Christmas shopping. Yeah, I don't even know why I'm treating that as an option. We're going Christmas shopping, but I do need to wash my hair first. Like, it's just every day at the moment, it's just a bad hair day. Like what? Oh, that's it. Fuck. Okay, so if you don't know, all I do to wash my hair is I switch my heater on, switch the pump on, and then I have this baddie in the shower. So if you don't know, I can take the top off and then I can actually shower in here. And that's like a curtain rail, but um, I, I can't be bothered. It's a bit warm, not gonna lie. Oh, I hate this song. Now I don't really know what to do because I don't have a hairdryer. I'm supposed to be going out. Oh, that's a good look. Me spraying this hair stuff, hoping it's gonna solve all my life problems. I don't think it's going to. Okay, my hair's still wet, but kind of ready to go out. It's the vibe. Kind of need a belt, but not in the mood to wear one. Um, so let's go.
Christmas without celebrations. I'm still birthday shut up. <laughs> Okay, going back to the van because my feet hurt and I'm tired of carrying stuff. <laughs> I did so much shopping. That was delightful. I love walking around towns at Christmas. It's the best time, you know. Minus all the people. Yes, I got my final Christmas presents. So it's very exciting. Hello. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching as per usual. And I hope you have a wonderful Christmas. I don't know what we're gonna be doing yet, but we, no we don't. Um, uh, but yeah, I'll see you next week. Bye. Mm -hmm.